We begin tonight with the high profile case of Kristen Smart, the father and son accused in her murder. We're in a Salinas courtroom for the first time today. Case was initially going to be tried in San Luis Obispo County, but the judge decided to move it to Monterey County. With more on what happened in court today, here's Action News 8 reporter Felix Cortez reporting live for us. Paul and Ruben Flores, the son and father pair, charged in connection with the disappearance and murder of Kristen Smart, making their first court appearance in Salinas since their high-profile case was moved from San Luis Obispo County. Monday morning, Judge Jennifer O'Keefe ruled two juries will be seated in this trial, one for each defendant. That means calling in one of the largest jury polls. More than 1,500 potential jurors will be summoned for jury selection. Paul Flores, a classmate of Kristen Smart and the last person to be seen with her, has been charged with murder. His father charged with accessory. Monday, Paul's defense attorney tried to have his case dismissed, arguing prosecutors acted with outrageous government government conduct in its effort to gather evidence. Judge O'Keefe said there was no indication of misconduct. The trial is moving ahead as planned. Defense also argued that they should be able to present evidence that someone other than Paul Flores is responsible for Smart's murder. Her remains have never been found. Judge denied the request. So jury selection scheduled to begin June 20th with opening statements scheduled for July 6th. This trial expected to last until October. Reporting from the Salinas Courthouse, I'm Felix Cortez, KSBW, Action News 8.